Hey Tested, I'm Simone and we're here with a person from the internet, from YouTube. <laughs> I'm Diana from the channel Physics Girl. Yeah, so you do a bunch of physics videos. I do, I do. I do a lot of demonstrations and physics about space and all kinds of physics stuff. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that we could educate me a little bit because I need to get on my educating game. I would be happy to teach you a little physics, yeah? Simone. Yeah, so like little known fact, I studied physics for a year in college, but a little bit too little experience. So today we are gonna do an experiment and it's something yes. that you did on your YouTube channel. Yes. Basically these DIY magnetic trains. Yeah, these are little, like super easy to make electric trains, electric magnetic, because it uses magnets and it also uses electricity flowing from a battery. Mm -hmm. So it's basically just copper wire, a battery we're using AAA, but you can use bigger, smaller batteries and some neodymium magnets. You want really, really strong magnets for this because they have to be able to pull the weight of the battery just by the electricity. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So and what, one of the issues that you ran into when you did your video is that you need to wrap, so you need to coil uh, this this magnetic or this copper wire, mm -hmm. and that's a really tedious project. Yes. Or it just takes a it, long time. I did 195 feet of copper wire by hand, just sort of sitting there watching Harry Potter or something. It's like know. you're not knitting. <laughs> you're no. just like wrapping. You're, not, you're literally yeah. wrapping around in a circle. Ain't nobody got time for that. I'm thinking that we'll do a drill. We'll do... This is not a drill, but like it, it really is. Do what? It's like a play on it's words not, between drill, like. It's not like a fire drill. It's it, a real drill. It fell flat. Got on it the right. <laughs> Just hate on the foreigner. But basically, I'm thinking that we can just have this like little mm -hmm. brass pipe turn and have me feed our copper wire to it. I don't know if this is gonna work. I think it's a good idea. And we also put another rod inside of this tube so that you can actually hold onto this side without mm -hmm. this part spinning. Yeah. So the only issue is that we need to like attach this copper wire to the pipe by yeah. some means. So I'm thinking duct tape. So well, look at that. Yeah. Look at that tautness. Oh, I just <laughs> want it to be taut. This is working really well. I'm contributing. <laughs> oh my god. Is this what it feels like to be a good person? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> look at okay. That evenness, Simone. Yeah. Yeah. I, I worked on my feeding. That looks good. Yeah. You fed it well. Okay. This is way better than doing it by hand because it looks really even and you want it to be much more even because otherwise yeah. the magnets get caught on the tracks. It's like a little, did you have like those slinkies when you were a kid? Like, um, you like climb down a stair? Yeah. Are those, are those called slinkies? They are, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, so we have our track which is just like plain non-coated copper wire. Does it need to be the same amount of magnets on each side? Um, it, do, uh, it doesn't really matter, but what you want to make sure that you do is put the same magnetic poles on either side of here. And how do you know if you've done that? Well, you'll know because it won't you work. You it? That's the only thing I know about you testing like batteries. <laughs> no, 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 no. Like you want to put north and north on north here and north here. But how do you know which one's which? Or south here and south here. Oh, so you want to see if this one connects to that one? We want that one to repel that one? Yeah, exactly. Oh, so those connect? Yeah, so that's the wrong side. Okay. Yeah. Did I pass the test? Brilliant. <laughs> you get a physics degree. <sighs> you get have a physics You get yeah. a physics degree. You get a physics degree. Okay. You get a physics degree. Okay. I mean. So then you just try putting it. If it doesn't go through, doesn't pass through one way, you just turn it around and try to do that. Okay. Okay. Moment of truth. Yeah. Ah, oh, it's just yeah. vibrating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's, it's the wrong way. Turn Why? around. Wait, wait, wait. That's so cool. Why does it vibrate? <laughs> yeah. So it's vibrating because it's actually you're pushing it in and it wants to go back out. So turn it around. Ah. Turn the whole thing okay, around. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. And then we go like that. Yeah. Okay. Ta-da! Cool. It was a little bit slow. It's a little I like a little bit underwhelming. No, this is a little, this is a bit, a bit of a slow train. We can try a different battery. We can see if this one's maybe a little dead. So what's actually going on here? 
I mean, the science. Science. I mean, I know current that moves creates a magnetic field, and the magnetic field pushes the magnets in some way. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's oh. so so. <laughs> Is this like so tired of life? There might be too many magnets. Like it's actually too heavy. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. So this is when so you're much. right. Current flowing through a wire like this creates a magnetic field. That's what you said, right? Can you say that again? <laughs> current flowing. No, no. 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 The Focus part about it. me being right. <laughs> Simone, you were right. <laughs> Feels so good. <laughs> Current flowing through a wire mm -hmm. produces a magnetic field. And a magnetic field will push a magnet. Okay. You made sure that they're facing the right way? No. All right, I got it. Good job. Got it. Thank Good you. Job. You would have found did out. Did you ever consider becoming a teacher? <laughs> like, did you make sure it was facing the right way? Do you think I'm a good teacher? No, you're I'm just scolding like so, you. Like, no, you're encouraging. I feel like I want to get your <laughs> approval. Yay! <laughs> it works so well. It's like we're going to an amusement park and then it just has like one of those slow trains. <laughs> Do we have other magnets? Can we try bigger batteries? We could try, yeah. If we have bigger magnets and bigger batteries, like a, this would be perfect for like a double A battery with slightly bigger magnets mm -hmm. instead of a triple A battery. Okay, let's iterate. <laughs> so, got some bigger batteries, some AA batteries, and some bigger magnets. Mm, but no. So so you want to you wanna have the magnets touching either side of the coil so that the electricity flows, and, and those probably won't be touching the other side of the coil because they're bigger than the battery. But Simone insists that we try, so. I mean, I can't take anything for granted. Yeah. Don't believe the physics. <laughs> Don't believe physics, no. girl. Just test, Simone. I encourage this kind of questioning. You say reality. that, but you don't sound very encouraging, I must say. You just said I was an encouraging teacher. Okay, I take it all back. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> could be in the wrong way. <laughs> that could be the problem. <laughs> Let's try with another. What if we do these? Like that. Yeah, it could work. Because now we got bigger magnets. Mm, I don't think so. I think it's that it's not actually touching this part. The electricity is actually flowing through the magnets. So the magnets are acting like an electrode on either end of the battery. What if we do that? The magnets are part of your circuit. Okay, 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 okay. Got this. Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's something. It is something, it yeah. is something. I think, you know, it's working really well, super easy to do, but I think that this, that we've just gotta, we've gotta make the track a little bit smaller. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, we iterated a couple of times, and that's more than anyone. I feel like you weren't impressed enough with the fact that it went through it all. Okay, no, uh, I'd seen it on the internet before. <laughs> and it was faster. And you're it like, was faster. My, my train is not fast enough. <laughs> my train is not fast enough. <laughs> no, I, I am impressed that it's going through it, and I'm impressed with you. Aww. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you so much for being on Tested. I mean, this was pretty cool. If you want to see it go faster, watch out, check out the video on, <laughs> on your channel, Physics Girl. Mm -hmm. We'll put a link in the description. And yeah, thank you so much for being here. Yeah, what? thanks for having me. Where next, can time we... I'll, next time I'll bring my magnets. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 let's blame it on the magnets. I like that. Also, where can people find you? They can find me on uh, just Google Physics Girl, youtube.com slash physics girl, something like that. Yeah, something like <laughs> that. You'll find it. You got it, internet. You can find her. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Talk to you later.